Hey everybody, it's Neil here from Post to Post coming at you with uh, six concepts for you to look at. These are from the PWHL. We talked recently about jerseys, uh, names, potential names for these teams and whatnot. So uh, someone actually came up with some, some concepts, some jersey concepts and sent them in. So we'll take a look and see their vision. The designer is TWG Designs. Thank you so much for sending these in. I really appreciate it. There's only six, so this is gonna be a long video. Uh, I've not seen these, so let's uh, let's take a peek and see what's up. First one's gonna be Boston. Boston Wicked. Okay. <laughs> I'm, I, I, I really like it. I, I love the colors, the striping's fine. I love the logo, the hockey aspect to it is amazing. However, that's a witch, which rhymes with whatever. And I think a woman being called a witch is probably offensive. So I can't imagine they would go with this logo. I like the logo. I like the name. I just think it would invite way too many negative comments. And that is the sad world that we live in because like, I work in marketing and branding and stuff and when, I, this is the process that you have to go through when you're coming up with logos and names and, and branding and stuff. You have to have foresight to think of these things and, and understand that this may be looked at this way or in a different culture, this name actually means this and stuff. So it's, it's risky. It's a crazy world out there right now. And um, yeah, these are the things you need to kind of think about, but I, I like it. I like it. I just don't know if that logo is super plausible, I guess. Let's go on to the next one. It's going to be Minnesota, Minnesota, what? <laughs> Minnesota Superior. This is actually a really nice jersey. I love the colors. A very simple logo. Uh, Superior as in Lake Superior. You got the fish on there. Nice, actually stylized numbers. It's a little bit hard to read, but I kind of liked a little bit of character in that font. That's pretty cool. Yep. Uh, next, the Montreal Echo. So as if you did watch that original video where I talked about the trademark names and stuff. I was not a fan of uh, the Montreal Echo. I do not like that name. In terms of this logo, it's it's not bad. I would say that I really like the jersey. The way that the jersey's designed with the lighter blue on the bottom of the sleeves, and, and, and the logo has great color balance with the rest of the jersey. That is actually brilliant the way that that's done, but I'm not a big fan of the actual logo. I think just having like the island of Montreal on there, it makes it look, almost look like a bit of a smile. I guess, and then with the letters in there, I can almost see like teeth or something. I'm not sure, but yeah, I'm not, I don't love the logo, but I love the jersey. Next, we got the New York Sound. Oh, so a different interpretation of, of sound here. This, you know what? This is actually a really cool jersey. I don't love the logo. I, I guess, you know what? It might actually look pretty cool if it was physically produced. I love the numbers. The numbers are awesome. I like the jersey. A little bit of gradient in there as well, I think in that orange, from orange to red possibly, uh, vertically up. And a gradient also um, in the neck as, as well. Uh, you know what? I'm kind of coming around to that logo actually. I didn't I didn't love it at first, but now it's it's pretty decent. It's a bit busy, but it's, you know, it's decent. All right. Next, the Ottawa Alert. Well, Giving the history of the Ottawa Senators, current and original Ottawa Senators back in the 1920s or whenever that was, I kind of don't mind the like a uh, wrestling belt sash kind of look. And that is so rare for me to say, because I do not typically like that in Jersey concepts. It is a huge no-no of mine, but I don't mind it here. And I think it might have to do with number one, the, the city, the history of the city, the history of the team. Obviously this is, I'm talking about Senators, not the alert. But, and also the colors. I, I think it kind of works with the colors as well. It's still likely my least favorite of all of them so far. I think we've got one to go, but I I, I don't mind it actually. Yeah, I, 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 don't, I don't hate it, hate it. We'll move on to the last one, Toronto Torch. Okay, so if I'm not mistaken, I might actually have to double check, but I think that kind of design that you see along the bottom, which looks like the bottom of a T comes from the city flag. Toronto City flag. I just want to make sure. Yeah, okay, so that is, it's the Toronto City flag that you kind of see there along the bottom. And the the rest of the jersey is just a jersey. I mean, that's that's really kind of what it comes down to there. I I, I understand why, like I, when I first saw that, the, what made me think of the flag wasn't necessarily the layout, is that the layout was offset to the left because that's how it is on the flag. And I remembered that. And I'm looking at the flag now, I can confirm it. I'll throw it up on the screen there as well. 
But on a jersey, I don't like that. That looks it looks like a mistake. It looks like a mistake on the flag too, if I'm being completely honest. But on the jersey, it does look like a mistake. I like the idea behind it, but I wouldn't go full mirrorization, if that's a word, on the actual flag to jersey. I would keep that completely centered. And and I think that's okay, actually. I like the logo. Actually, I really like the logo. The logo's awesome. Colors are nice. It's, it's good. I think my favorite overall, they're, you know what, they're all pretty good. The auto one one's my least favorite. I'll definitely say that. I think as far as color, color balance, I think I like the Montreal one the most in terms of color. But overall, taking everything into consideration, logo, color, jersey design in general, I think I'll have to give it to Toronto, actually. Um, with that fixing the, the bottom in mind. And I understand TWG designs, I completely understand your logic and reason behind it. Um, I'm not really questioning that, but I would like to see that centered. If that was centered, you know, I wouldn't really, would, wouldn't really change anything about this jersey. So uh, this would be my favorite. Um, honestly, they were all pretty good. Even the Ottawa one that I have last and didn't really like, I could still, I'd be okay with it actually. So great job. <laughs> There's only six to look at, but you know, that's fun. That's the fun part about new leagues coming in, new teams. Um, the NHL is great to look at. There's 32 teams. There's lots to work up with, lots of history. But when you got something new, that's fun. So thank you once again, TWG Designs, for sending those in. I had a blast looking at those. Let me know down below in the comment section which was your favorite. And would you like to see any other names for those teams in the future of that league? Let me know. If you're new to the channel, would love to have you on board. Hit the subscribe button. Would love to have you here. And if you did enjoy this video, hit the like button. Talk to you guys soon. Adios. Thank <laughs> you.